What is going on YouTube? Sniper336 coming to you here with a Unipad instructional video. Now, for today, I've been seeing a lot of questions on people asking, how do you download packs? How do you be able to download it to where you can play it? Because whenever you download a pack, it always shows that the sound key or key sound does not exist. Well today, I'm going to go over that problem with you guys, and I'm going to try to show you step by step, and I'm going to try to make it the best instructional video out there. Um, do note that this phone that I am using is a LG phone, uh, Android phone, so if you have iPhone, things like that, it might not work as easy, but you still might be able to do it. Anyway, let's get to the video. Um, first off, you're going to need one one app basically to help you do this uh thing and that app will be the explorer app which is this little app right here um so basically what this app will do is it will allow you to be able to get the file to be able to extract it into your unipad game now if you do not know what the meaning of extract is then continue to watch, uh, and other than that, this could be helpful. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is you want to go to any type of YouTube channel that will supply any links for Unipads, uh, for a Unipad project file. So, what we're going to do is we're going to go on to YouTube, and we're going to look up Unipad project files now this will give you a few uh, choices some of these youtubers uh, you have to download it a totally different way I believe uh, the Tobu the Tobu uh, Unipod loader uh, I couldn't download any of his packs but we're gonna try to see if we can download this project file so if you go to the description, the ones that say plus project file, most of these YouTubers will post a link down to whatever song uh, basically you're trying to download. So, as an example, I haven't really looked into the song, so I don't know it too well, but basically I'm going to click the link here. It's going to take me to the project file. Um... Now, most of these YouTubers I have not actually received any viruses from, or any viruses from, so most of them are pretty safe. And then what you want to do is hit download project file. Now, you want to wait until the project file is done loading. Okay, download is complete. Now, this is where the Explorer app will come into handy. Okay, so, you go to your Explorer app. You're going to have one of two things. You're going to have two applications that you are going to need, but you also have to have the Unipad software to do this, but I'd imagine most of you would. Okay, so you'll have your Unipad's uh, project file, and you'll have your download file. Now, as we've downloaded this project file, which is Tobu Colors, it's going to come up in a zip file. Now, the zip file is going to be in the downloads. Now, as you can see, I have downloaded plenty of songs, and I will be able to show you guys some of the songs that are available. So, as you can see down at the bottom, you've got Tobu Colors. Now, what you want to do to this project file is you want to click it. Okay, so it's got autoplay, it's got your info, you've got your key LED, your key sound, and your sounds. Okay, so this project file is, oh, is good. So, now what you want to do is you want to hold that project file... And up at the very top left, you'll see kind of like a box with a corner type of deal to it, which is that one right there. So, as you do it, so hold it. Oh, nope, not that one. I have already extracted that one. So you want to hold Tobu Colors, and you want to hit that button. Okay, so now what you want to do, the it is copied into your little notebook now that will stay there until you go to your unipad software so what you want to do is you want to go down to your unipad software and 
what you want to do is you want to hit this little clipboard. Now what it's going to do is it's going to extract all the files that are in that file. Most of them will take pretty, uh, or most of them are pretty quick to download. Most of them I haven't seen over a 35 megabyte download uh, software, and most of the time uh, they download pretty quickly. Okay, so now you can see Tobu Colors or Tobu Colors is in the UniPads uh, software. So now the the it is in there. The UniPad is going to recognize it as a project file that has been installed into the into the app itself. So basically what you want to do is you want to exit out of uh, the Explorer and then you want to go load UniPad. Okay. So now that UniPad is downloaded, you're going to get this little thing which you usually should get just letting you know the terms of service and blah 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 for all that, uh, then they talk about the patches and bug fixes. So basically you hit accept, alright that's good. Now as you can see it is not in here. Now next part to this you want to hit load unipack. Okay so basically it's gonna pop up for different types of project files. So basically if you were to start off here you would hit SD card download and then you're gonna see the Toby color zip file now mine has already been set up that way uh, I think your guys should be set up the same way but if not just kinda look through until you can find the uh, project file through any type of zip file so basically once you click it it's gonna give you um, it's going to analyze it and sometimes it will say the key sound is not in place and sometimes it will allow you to actually go ahead and just play it now I, I will give you I'm going to try to find an example for you guys when it comes to downloading a project file but if you do it correctly and the project file communicates with you extremely good then basically the analysis is already complete the game is installed into UniPad and you don't have to worry about anything else. Now you can play the app. So as you guys saw, I didn't have colors in the little uh, box. So basically I'm going to click here. I'm going to let it load. And then we will show you guys that it actually, the app actually works. Okay, so we got the project file loaded. So now I'm going to go ahead and hit autoplay and I'm going to hit record order. That way you guys can actually see that it is working properly. Uh, we're going to turn up the sound and we're going to hit autoplay just to show you guys that uh, key sounds are all in. Okay, so now as you guys can see, all of the sound keys are in and the app totally works. So that is one little trick to do if the app is basically if you want to play a song. Now, as an example for the app, so say I'm going to go into Unipad and I'm going to back out and I'm going to see if I still have a file that I had problems downloading myself. Okay, so I'm going to hit load Unipack. 
Um, and I do not have that project file that I downloaded. So basically, how this works. Okay, so one of the, one of the songs is called Timmy Trumpets. Now, I was curious on basically how to download this one because I was having problems with it. So, we're going to type in Unipad Timmy Trumpets or Timmy Trumpet. And basically it's going to come up as I believe it was from this guy. Yeah, it was from this guy. Okay. So, as you can see, you've got the link down below. Now, this one is a little different from the other one, all because the project file is there, but it the file actually has to be extracted from the actual file that it is actually been come that it came from. Now let me show you how this works. Okay, so I click Drive Google. So as I click the link, it's going to give you a little download file. So as you can see, the little arrow down with the line, basically you're going to hit that. And I have not had any problems with this, so if your device does say um, that it has uh, that it is going to have a virus attached to it, I don't think it will, just because I've already played it. I haven't had any problems with my device, and I have not seen any type of virus uh, problems. So now that it's downloaded, what you want to do is you want to go to Explore. Okay, so, now that we have the little, uh, let's see, today is November 21st, so let's see, oh, it is not in Unipad, so what you want to do is you want to go to that, and basically, you want to find that project file. Okay, so I got Timmy Trumpet's Savage Freaks 1. Okay, so, as I said before, you're going to hold it, and you're going to copy it. Basically, you're going to go right back to the Unipad, and you're going to paste the file. Okay, so now the file is there. We got Timmy, Fre Timmy Trump and Savage Freaks number one zip file. So you go back to the app, and... I will be right back with you guys. Okay, we're back. Alright, so as you guys can see, you got the Timmy Trumpets zip file. And you basically want to click it. And I'm not sure if... Okay, so as you can see, this sound key does not exist. But as you can see, I have the Timmy Trumpet and Savage Freaks. Now... It is actually not downloaded into the app. Now, this was the part that I told you guys. You had to go in and basically extract the file that it came... Extract the file to the file that it actually came from. So, basically, what you guys want to do is you want to go to Explore. And, as you can see, you got the Trumpet and Savage Freaks 1. Okay, so you click it. And just for sake time, we're going to do information, if I can open it, key sound, sounds, okay, so from here, as you can see, it is already there. So basically you want to hold it down just like I showed you guys in the other one. Then you want to click the little arrow with a line under the arrow. You want to click it and it's going to extract files. So once it says extracted su successfully, you want to go to the extracted file. So once the file is extracted, now here is the easy part. It is basically the same thing that I said before. Once the file is extracted, it is 
pretty easy to st start from there. So basically, you want to hold it, then you want to copy it. So once that's done, you want to paste it. So, actually what I'm going to do is I'm going to pause the video and I will be right back. Okay, so we're back. So now, as I have explained, to basically fix this file, now I have removed my Timmy Trumpet and Savage file to show you guys that it will work. So as we go back to Unipad, nope, oh, mercy, I'll be right back. Alright, to show you guys that I have deleted the file, just to show you that it does work, you want to go to the Tobu Colors, you want to go to the Desmion Hellcat, and as you can kind of see, there's no Timmy Trumpets. So basically, you want to go back, and now that I've shown you that I have deleted it, we are going to go back to the Explorer file. Okay, so now that I've showed you guys that the file is already extracted. We're gonna go back and I wanna try to find that extracted file. Okay, actually don't, let's not worry about that. All right, so we'll go ahead and re-download it. So as we got the file in the Unipad file, you wanna click it then you want to hold this file. You want to copy it. File has been successfully extracted. You want to hit go to. Then you want to hold that file and you want to hit copy. So now once that file is copied, you want to go back to the Unipad and then you want to extract that file or copy that file. So it is a really really small one, 3 megabytes. Alright, so we use the file that was holding the Timmy Trumpets and Savage Freaks, and we extracted that file. Okay, so now that you've got that file out, what you can do is the Timmy, Tr Timmy Trumpet and Savage Freaks dot zip file, you want to hold it and can it. So now that that file is done and gone, you don't have to worry about it messing with your game. So now that we have extracted the file, and it's now sitting in Unipad, the app should work. So as you go back in, and this one I believe you don't have to load Unipad, and as soon as you open it, it'll be sitting right in your game. So that is the two versions on how to download a Unipad project file if you cannot have a sound key, if you are having a sound key problem. If you guys have any questions, leave it down in the comments below, comment section below, and maybe I have missed something or have not answered your guys' questions completely. Let me know, know down in the comment section below, and I will try to help you out the best that I can. I hope you guys enjoy your day, and stay safe. And if you guys are new, Please make sure to subscribe, hit the like button if you guys really enjoy the content and it helped you. Please also leave a comment down below and let me know if it helped you or not. That way I kind of know exactly how I was able to assist you guys when it come to this little problem that many people have. As I said before, I hope you guys have a good day and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.